So Rachel, what brought you to hashtag feeling myself? Um, I saw it advertising and well, you're my friend. <laughs> so I was like, you know, we should support each other. We should support each other's arts work and everything like that. And I was like, hey, maybe, maybe I should attend these sessions and actually see how I feel and what's really going on because, you know, it's self-confidence in LGBT youth. And um, I was explaining to some of the persons that are here tonight my story about coming out and all of that, and it's been kind of a battle. So I thought that these sessions would actually build me a bit better. Can you say that specifically in your life, feeling myself has done something specific for you, like personally, like you? Death. Um, before doing these sessions and that kind of thing, I was very much into myself, very much closed off. I mean, I'm very expressive and very open, but only if someone were to approach me. Um, I think out of these sessions, I have grown so much. I made so many new friends, gained so many different new, like different experiences. I attended new files, that's something that I would have never done on my own before attending these sessions. Um, and before I, I'm a dancer, and I don't sing at all, like that's not my strong point. And these sessions have me singing, <laughs> even though I can't sing for shit. So I, I feel like I have grown and I have openly come out of a box, out of a shell that I, I put myself in and I appreciate that. Thank you so much, Rachel. Thank nice you. having Rachel on stage, guys. Thank you.